We've dramatically refined your direct modeling capabilities with the new Deform tool. This means you can bend, taper, or create a bulge with practically any geometric object. We've also expanded the functionality of the original Twist tool to include new modes and options, making the possibilities endless. This tool has three new modes in addition to Twist, Taper, Bulge, and Bend. Not to be confused with the Taper Face tool, the Taper Solids mode of the Deform tool will taper an entire object all at once, rather than just one face. As with the Taper mode, Bulge mode allows you to deform a selected object directly, either expanding it outwards or crushing it inwards. Here we see the object being warped both side to side and front to back. If multiple objects are selected, they will be bulged away from or towards a similar point, but each of them will be modified in a different way, depending upon the location of the indicator. Previously, the only way to create an object with multiple turns and bends along it was an extrude along path. However, it was difficult to use if you weren't sure how much of a bend you wanted or needed before you drew the path object. To this end, we've added the Bend Solid mode to the Deform tool. However, this tool is far more than meets the eye. Here was a complex extrude, custom made from a series of polygons. In previous versions, there was no easy way to manipulate the path of this object after it had already been created. If we wanted to wrap this object around a curved wall, or otherwise alter it, there was no method of doing so. Now, we can simply enter a top view, click once at both ends of the object, and bend it to any desired degree, even wrapping it into a complete circle, 360 degrees.